Everybody, it's Josh and Yah here with another Let's Play. It's a short review of a game I found on Game Jolt, and uh, it's not on Newgrounds, but the person made an announcement on Newgrounds, so they're like a member of it. Um, and I saw it, it looked interesting, decent reviews, um, and it's hopefully maybe we'll get built upon, because it's got a lot of potential from what I hear. It's called Inside the Seaside Inn. Say that six times fast. Inside the Seaside Inn. Bleh. But anyway... Uh, I don't know very much else about this game, so it's a horror game, that's all I know. We'll see. Oops. Alright, the Seaside Inn has been vacant for over 50 years, but tonight the lights are on. Someone has just checked into an old abandoned motel. A curious child. Dramatic. Oh, let me open up the recording rectangle. Sorry, guys. It's also not running, like, for some reason, the recording software won't recognize it, so I gotta do it this way. Alright. Woo, look at your hair go. It's like a... Man. It's like you're running into a breeze. Alright, uh, can we... E to use? Alright, we're just moving, I guess. Let's get this out of here. Alright. No idea what's happening. A lot of blinky lights. Okay. We'll go in there, I guess. Your hair's not gonna go flapping in the wind through here. If anything, the breeze is coming from it's in the in the air duct, but well, you know, whatever. Electric is still apparently working because the lights are flickering. All right. Whoa! Table? What the hell? That's enough of that. What? I can crouch and I can jump. Okay. Whoa. A little glitchy, I see. So, what do we do here? Is that it? Okay. I don't know if I'm actually going to play through this whole thing. Depends on how long it is. Speaking of which, I should probably turn on my timer. But, uh... There we go. I at least want to give some people, like, a, hey, look at this thing. Heads up type of deal. What? Okay, apparently there's a door there. Did not... May want to put something where, you know, hey, there's a door at the end of the hallway. Talking to the developer here. Okay, ah, uh, jump... There we go. Jump left or right to get off ladders? I will. What's over here? Nothing. Jump. Oh, nice double jump. Can we go in there? Okay. Yeah, there needs to be something to differentiate dif differentiate what doors are usable. Oh, an axe. What are you? Was that a person? Ooh. Uh, you want to watch it there? Why is stuff moving? Something came out of the water and it won't let us. It looks like it says Letus, like a name, like like fetus. Leave. All right. Let's move. It's this way. Anything interesting? No. Over here. Just death. Nope. There you go. What did I just get? Oh, a room key. All right. We are all minnows in the eyes of the dark one. Who's the dark one? Satan? Satan would be dark. All right. Let's go downstairs. downstairs. Is it unlocked? It's unlocked. All right. Woo! What was that? Did I just get hurt? I got hurt. I barely even saw it. Like, something was floating. That's all I know. What was the point in coming in here? Just to get hurt? Or was that the... What are you? Uh, excuse me? What? Where? I'm, like, teleporting around. All I'm doing is Z, and it's like, Boomy, you're surprised. What? What? Where am I? Okay. 
the biggest I mean it's it's got so much potential uh person who made this game but I'll have to get your name after this um but like I said you can find it on Game Jolt for yourself I'll, of course the link is going to be in the description but the developer of this game who has so much more talent by the way and I'm kissing a little bit of ass because I don't want you to think I'm just completely ripping your game apart because I don't know how to make games but as a game player like there has to be some way to figure out what is interactable and, and what isn't I mean I see some things have moss grown over it but I'm seriously I, like, I just push I push Z and I'm just like somewhere else I have no idea why I don't know what I'm looking for there's a vent there. I see that. What is this? I apparently that was a door. I don't know. Did I go in here? This is that place I got hurt at. So and there's okay. Let's go back out. And I see again. That was the door I came in. Now I'm someplace completely different. And I'm pressing Z again. And I'm where am I now? Like what? Do you do you see what I'm saying? What are you? What are you? Ooh. Excuse me? Oh, good. Well, at least I don't have to start a million years back. Okay. Pain? What? Okay. That was pretty creepy. And the, it sounded like a jungle sound, but... If you took out the jungle monkey noise in the background, that would have been pretty good sound effect. All right. So let's go towards pain. Okay. Long. Long vent. All right. We got. Okay. There's our axe. Maybe a better animation for the axe swing, too, because, I mean. Apparently the axe is just swinging out of my chest. What are you? Okay, that one that one's pretty creepy. Good job on that one. This is kind of gross. Good job. How do I do that? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, okay. That's what that does. Can I just run past? Ow. Okay, I got a key. Let's not do that again. It's good, uh, good touch with the the creaking effects. I really think I'm it's like feels like I'm going to fall through. So there are good, like I said, there's there's pluses to this game, but there's a lot there's a lot of room to go. Polish, uh, Z, please. Will you hurt me, naked woman? Okay. I'll take that. And where am I now? I don't know. Fuck you, dog. You don't go barking at my nuggets like that. Woo! Good sa I, I will say, that is one of the bigger strengths of this. Is You have good sounds. Good sounds. Good choice. Creeping me out. All right. What? This is the same room I was just in. Why? They're very broken. Excuse me. Where? I've already gone to pain, so. And maybe don't let the health continuously regenerate. That kind of makes it uh, a little bit too easy there. Uh. Okay. It's very confusing because I, I have no idea where I'm going right now. Okay. I've been here. Been there. I have not, I don't think I've been here yet. So let's go in here. Yes, this is new. Alright, good. Jump. Is that a snake? Not anymore. It's not a snake anymore. It makes you see what is not there. Okay, thanks for that tidbit. And hate room. Why not? 
Sounds like a lovely room. Okay, just get the axe ready. Hello? Kill, 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 That was a good room. Whew. That was a good room. Good job on that. Good job. Okay, I guess there's nothing there. It wasn't very, like, after... I don't know what the whole point of that was, but, you know. It was scary, but then there was no threat. So, moving on. Okay. So the, I I think what the point of the game is, the overall overarching point is to find keys to get you from to to progress. That's what it seems like to me. It's just that it's very confusing as to where to go. Up up for love of god, what is that? What is that? What are you? Are you a sea monkey? I'm not touching that. Okay, you can't hurt me. Alright, we're good. Okay, let's just get out of here. Places. I don't... I don't... What? What? Uh... Did I break it? No? Okay, these are all ghosts that can't touch me, hopefully. Creepy, creepy ghosts, but they can't touch me. So, again, no threat, but, uh, it still is creepy. So, good. what are you? Okay, that doesn't look like a ghost. Only the living can draw it from hiding? What does that mean? Who is talking to me? What is this? Can't go in here? No. I'm just kind of mashing the, the use button. I'm just... Because I don't know where to go. I, I'm, I'm in forward, I guess. What are you? Run like the wind. Wow. Forrest Gump up in this shit. Whoa. I was safe upstairs? What the fuck is that? Well, anyway. Well, now you see me die. You've seen the death sequence. That was pretty... Okay. okay. Basically, I'm just going to say... Uh, basically, it was, just, it was great job on the atmosphere. Uh, great job on, on the music and sound. And there were some jump scares, but they were most of them were pretty decent um, it wasn't really, the, it was a mix of the jump scare with the atmosphere that really f kind of startled me um, so it wasn't like a cheap just like bah, in your face jump scare, the bug scared me a little bit, whatever the hell that was um, not entirely sure of the theme I get it, it's on the coastal city so maybe those are, it's like a crustacean but I it's not a, I mean, I knew, and I know it's like a small indie game, so I don't really get the story. I am used to that. I'm kind of probably overthinking this. But the, the biggest things that need to be improved uh, are your the traveling. You got to you got to make it clear where it is that you need to go, like the doors, where they are and 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 where they lead to, because you kind of like pop around when you when you walk through a door you're like over here even though the door that came in is like over here it's what it seemed like to me but overall you have a really good game here a really good solid base to build on I would if, if you're watching this developer go in and do a redux of this game take the suggestions and feedback from whoever else might be critiquing this and make it a really good game because you have something don't give up on it it's good um, and I, I, if you if you make it a redux, let me know. 
and I will definitely give it another try. So, uh, overall, good job, good job. Um, to everyone else, if you like this video, click the annotations for more in the splash screen, and uh, thumbs up, subscribe, it really helps all your support. I love you guys. Thank you so much, and I will see you next time. Toodles! Oh, that got creepy real quick. Oh, Jesus! Fuck! Holy.